Man, that ice cream is good. Man. Yeah, man. Hey, you know what time it is? Yeah, it's time to watch Trucker Rudy. You gotta go watch Trucker Rudy. Yeah, let's go. out there today well we are doing fantastic if you're asking me yes indeed we are we had us a good night's sleep we had us a good meeting up yesterday with uh, Scott and Lisa that was awesome state motor ahead all right okay well, as you can see, we're obviously leaving Duluth now. Well, you probably can't see that we're leaving Duluth, but if you watched yesterday's video, <clears throat> you knew that I was stopping in Duluth and that I'm still at the same truck stop. Yeah. So, we want to try and make our way towards the boat. Turn left and then turn and left that to 700 is feet. South St. Marie. The next state we're going to be entering is going to be Wisconsin. And that's what the GPS is yelling at me for. State border ahead. That's just for Wisconsin. In 600 feet, turn left on Anita Street and then take the entrance that's to the That's not for Ontario feet. yet, but. Uh, Later on today, I expect to be in Ontario yet. Yeah? So we'll. Uh, we'll see if our border crossing will be cleared by the time we uh, get to the border, right? Yeah, I really hope so that this time it will be. So far I haven't gotten the cars, but Take the we got the, the ACI, but that was exactly the same last week. We got the ACI clearance, but we didn't get the cars, you know. So I'm really hoping for that they are going to make that happen today. That I'm not going to have to sit there for a couple of hours at the border, because that would suck. Because right now I got sort of plans. To meet up with somebody tomorrow afternoon or towards the evening. Yes, indeed I do. And I think that's going to be awesome. I'm a big fan of this guy. He makes YouTube videos as well. I watch a lot of his videos. So uh, if we do get to meet up with him tomorrow, you will know. You will know. Definitely. But uh, yeah, up there to the right, that's where you will see the big lake up here around the loose. Superior Lake, I believe they call it. Yeah. I need to put some oil on my seat, it seems like, or not, like on the seat, but you can hear that. It's getting annoying. In a quarter mile, <laughs> take I-535 US 53 but, South. But, uh, yeah. Anyways, we'll get on down the road here. We're gonna have to cross this big lake up here, and then uh, we will be in Wisconsin. That's right. And then, uh, once we get to Superior, Wisconsin, we got a big new scale up there yet. 
kind of curious if they're going to be pulling me in today. Yeah, last time I come across her, they were already open. But uh, I was lucky when I come up there. They were just busy at the point that I pulled past them. And they had closed the scale because there was a long line up there already for the scale. So they had closed there, so I didn't have to go across the scale. But we'll see what kind of luck we will have today, right? If you guys look right there to the right, you're going to see a big ship dock right there by them big tanks you see up there. Yeah, that's kind of what I was talking about the other day. You got these big ships coming in over here all the time and we're picking up all kinds of stuff over here. And I don't know exactly where to take it, but they do come here all the time and pick up freight over here. Just like what we are doing. We're picking up freight all the time and delivering it somewhere, right? W at 35 South US 53 South US 2. Well, that's exactly what these guys are doing. Slide right in 600 feet. Yes, RJ, we're going to do that. And I know somebody's going to make fun of it again. <laughs> I got a lady's voice on there and I call her RJ. You know? But uh, hey, that's okay. I just like that name. Feet, slide dry gun, <laughs> US to East, US 53 oh, South. Okay. Yeah. Keep to the left in 0.2 miles. We are now officially in Wisconsin. Yep. I'm just very happy today. I don't know. I was very happy yesterday and very it's happy today. Feet. Keep to the left on US 53. Yes, it's because finally everything is working out the way it should be, you know, in the trucking right now. Anyways, who knows how it's going to work out there at the end, but uh, yeah. Right now everything seems to be working fantastic. That's right. Alrighty guys, we have had us a little bit of a pit stop here a few minutes ago, but uh, here we are, back at her again, traveling on US 28 right now. Yeah, very few in between truck stops in this area, but well, we finally found one and a little bit of a time off over there and that is a bite to eat and now we're hitting the road again beautiful sunshine today indeed it is we probably have about three three and a half hours to the border right on lake superior circle tour us 41 all right we'll be turning on to us 41 before we will be back in Canada so I think what we're going to do is when we get uh, into South St. Marie I think we're going to go up to that Fly and J up there we'll go fuel up take us a shower and then uh, I don't know if we'll continue on from there yet or not but uh, we might we might but maybe we'll just uh, spend the night there but maybe we'll just go up to uh, maybe Sudbury or uh, In a yeah, I think mile, Sudbury is about right three hours. Lake Superior Circle Tour US 41. Uh, I don't know exactly how far it is but I think it's about three hours so that might be a good place to go for tonight and that way we would only have I don't know, maybe a couple of four or five hours left for tomorrow to go and then we'll be in Ottawa. That's right. But anyways, uh, here we are. Stop sign. I'm gonna make sure we stop. Looks like this is a bit of a bad corner too. Oh, we made it. That's all that matters. Continue on this road for 55 yeah, miles. Yeah, 55 miles. All right. Oh, they got DOT sitting 
in there today. Okay. Alright. Oh well, maybe he's doing an inspection on somebody. That's alright. As long as he lets me go, right? Yeah. But pretty soon we'll be coming up to the big lake up there. On 28, there is one stretch where uh, we drive right alongside the beach there or the big lake up there, you know. Beautiful to see up there, that's for sure. We're gonna try and show you guys that. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we are. Smile, you're on camera. Yeah, that's what they said right there on that little sign. <laughs> yeah. Well, they're gonna smile. <laughs> yeah, well, here we go. Here we're getting ready to go over this bridge up here in South St. Marie, Ontario. Well, this side is, I guess, Michigan, but uh, the other side is uh, Ontario. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, it's actually a gorgeous day to be crossing over here. I was looking over there at the big lakes beautiful up there but yeah I figured I don't usually cross here very often so I may as well show you guys right don't you think this is cool and you might think this is it right just this little hump new Siri Bob new way this bridge goes a long way yet it dips down a little bit but then it goes up Speed over warning. there again yes indeed it does yeah Yeah, it looks like they got a little bit of a waterfall up there and everything too. Yeah, they're working on that other bridge down there. I don't know if that's for the railway. Yeah, it looks like it's for the railway, yeah. So here we are coming up to the other, uh, basically bridge, I guess you want to call it. Yeah, I see still a little bit of ice up there, it looks like. I don't know if it just looks like it or if it's some kind of dirt. Yeah, that actually is ice, yeah. That definitely is ice, that's for sure. But we gotta see how we come into here again. I know at the bottom over here, they one kilometer. Turn right on. Uh, a Highway lot of construction going on over here. For the last little while. Last time I come across up here anyways, looks like they have uh, cleaned up some stuff over here to the right. Looks like an empty parking lot there now. And I think there used to be old buildings. They're no longer there anymore. But here we are. We are officially in Canada now. Yeah, that's right. So we're going to figure out exactly how we get to the customs up here. So. Uh, I guess I'm gonna let you guys go and then we'll see you guys on the other side. This is it guys. We have now crossed the border officially and uh, at the customs. So we are good to go. Yes, indeed we are. I'm happy about that. That was very easy crossing here today. I think the easiest I've had in a very long time. But yeah, now we're going to have to follow the GPS and the signs because we got to make sure we get onto Highway 17, right? That's the plan anyways. I have to see if we can find that Highway 17 because yeah, sometimes it can be a little difficult <laughs> up here. But we'll find it. We'll find it. Well, guys, as you can probably tell, we have had a shower. Yeah, much needed shower. We filled up the truck. <clears throat> oh yeah. Now we are going to try and make our way down towards uh, Sudbury, Ontario. I haven't quite figured out exactly how far it is up to there, but uh, we'll start making our way that way and see how far we can make it, right? <clears throat> That's the plan anyways. Shaved our face and all that good stuff. So uh, we are good to go. We are planning on meeting up with a very special person tomorrow. 
I'm very excited. Oh yeah, <laughs> I can't wait. I've been wanting to meet this guy ever since last year. Since the truck show last In year. Meters, turn left on. I became Second aware line of him or 17. just before the truck show. And uh, never worked out that we could meet up. And it looks like now it's going to be the time. So I, I'm well thinking a whole ahead. bunch of questions that I want to ask this fella. And all that good stuff. So uh, hopefully I won't be so excited that I, I forget all the questions that I want to ask him. <laughs> yeah, that would suck. But anyways, uh, it's already 5.30 in the afternoon. So we are getting out of here. We got a ways to go yet before we uh, get through South St. Marie. But uh, we will get through there. Certainly will. And uh, we'll make a good way down here yet today. My plan really is to make it down to uh, Sudbury. In two kilometers, slight right on Lack Road, Highway 17. So if that's about three hours, it's about three hours. Like I said, it's only like 5.30, so uh, 6.30, 7.30, 8.30, that's actually not too bad, you know. So 8.30, I can get up pretty early and be down in Ottawa for tomorrow just after lunch probably already so that would be awesome <clears throat> that would give us a lot of time to uh, talk and discuss discuss everything that we would like to I sure hope he has a little bit of time to meet with me so uh, very much looking forward to that that's for sure I hope you guys are excited too but you gotta stick around to find out who it is and plus you never know what could happen right something can always come up or something can happen and then we couldn't make it right or whatever you know or maybe he couldn't make it Maybe he got sick or whatever, you know? Things happen in life. So, but anyways, let's continue on with our journey. And let's see what happens for the rest of the day. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, we are done for today. We have made it as far as Sudbury, Ontario. And the parking lot is pretty full over here. So, uh, we kind of had to park over here where usually the cars would park when they come in here and do a little shopping or whatever but uh hey we managed to get us a spot and that's all that matters so uh we're gonna go to bed get up early tomorrow morning and uh we only have about five more hours to go you know we'll be in ottawa already so yeah that's exciting so uh figure well I'll close off this video for today and get me a good night rest and we'll be done. That's right. So I appreciate you guys joining me on today's vlog. Stick around for tomorrow. We got some awesome things happening tomorrow. Oh yeah. Definitely. So you don't want to miss it. With that being said, we'll see you right here on Trucker Rudy signing up. <laughs> behind me that day is gonna come